Hi, Lee McCartan, Director of Engineers at Borders Ireland and lecturer in Technology University Dublin, Ireland. So Liam, what were your overall impressions of the recent visit to the BIM programme in India? Well, I suppose our overall impressions really were of the staff. Hugely motivated, knowledgeable uh, Finn staff, all of the Finn ladies, huge thanks for hosting us, and of course intern Jubin, and AB led by field manager extraordinaire Mr. Brian Jockey. So huge thanks to all of the Finn team. I suppose the second overall impression, we were hugely impressed with the families we visited, who benefited from the Finn Ecosystem programs. Their pride in the toilets and washrooms that they had, and more importantly, their deep understanding of the maintenance and operation of the systems was really impressive. And this contrasted hugely with the community toilets we visited, which were largely unused, unusable, and neglected. Okay. And what do you see as the main challenges for? I suppose to sum up the main challenges, I would see them maybe threefold, social, technical and economic. I think from a social perspective, one of the core recommendations I would say that Finn need to do is to really document uh, an understanding of the program. And I think they can do this in two ways. A CAP survey, which is knowledge, attitude, practice, would really be useful amongst the uh, families that have benefited from the Ibrisan program to understand their thinking, their knowledge, and to share that knowledge then with the expansion of the program into new areas. And this is the second recommendation I would say, to do a similar CAP survey with the new communities who don't have toilets. And I think these two together could form a really important social baseline for the program going forward. Second challenge you see is technical. Finn have a design that works, it's cyclone resistant, it's accepted by the community and understood by the community. The challenge will be to standardize and modularize this system in a way in which communities can replicate for themselves. And the third key challenge, and it's a really important challenge, is economics. I think a core long-term aim of the program has to be to create an ecosystem program which limits the external reliance on subsidies, uh, on funding subsidies, and creates a model which can be self-financing, or largely self-financing. Now this may be through innovation in reducing the cost of the toilets, or innovative ways of financing through microfinance, etc. And tell me, what about the opportunities for expansion in the future? There are huge opportunities. The first opportunity obviously arises with the India Model Village program, where Finn has the opportunity to engage in this program, which is designed as a government program, designed to improve water and sanitation throughout India. A second opportunity really is to engage with international partners international universities, NGOs and experts, and also with national partners such as the National Institute of Technology and Cherry. I think these partners can really improve the learning going forward. So, Gurmila Mila Mahabud, Gurmila 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 Mahabud,